Well, hello and welcome to a game that showcases the longest standing rivalry in international football. For a time, the greatest rivalry, certainly the longest lasting one. It is a game written into footballing folklore, a blueprint for all derbies, international and otherwise, that have followed it. So here we have it. I hope you are ready for this ultimate roller coaster. It is, of course, England versus Scotland. Well, it is a great view inside Wembley. It gives it that special feeling no matter which match it is hosting. And we rise now for the English national anthem. This is a friendly, but a friendly only in name. Well, exhibition match sounds like an easy Aussie game of football, Peter, and a picture-perfect occasion until the word pride gets a mention. And it's likely to have quite a big say between teams that could easily be sucked into an excuse for another feud. Why let an exhibition match get in the way of that? So these two will be going at it very, very strongly. So it's away we go then. Kyle Walker. <coughs> and he's going long. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, I mean, he, I think he did well to, to spot the run. He just didn't get enough behind it. It happens. It's a decent ball. Shapes to shoot! Goal, Scotland! Uh, given such an open invitation, he was always going to shoot. Well, he made it obvious as to where the pass should be played, Peter, and it made the finish look that bit easier. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Yeah, I think for them to get their noses in front away from home was brilliant, but these home fans will demand a response. Oh, well defended, that had to be done. Forward it goes. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Foden, and here's Kane. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Foden, massive leap! A oh, great save, real class. Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. Kane. Now it's Sterling. And he's onside. They've won a corner. Strong punch. Tries to get it forward quickly. Oh, sweet feet. Scotland have opted to really stretch the game now. Yeah, that's pretty evident, but... What's their thinking? Um, I, it looks as if the opposition are happy to defend the width of the 18-yard box, trying to remove that compactness. It's Kane! This could fall anywhere! Cleared without complication. 
Looks to thread it through. Nicely measured pass. And that's the end of that. It all started well enough. And it's Sterling. Now it's Kane. Just brushed off the ball there. Well, that's where he wants it. Uh, the ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Sterling, and the shot! And that's it! Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. and we're all square. Look, this is not for the faint-hearted, Peter. This is hard and fast football. It's on a plate. Sterling! Gets it back. Out to the right. Swung over. Header! In for the pieces. They have their reward! Foden is quick to move in. Keeper's handling wasn't great. Oh, Peter, you can't teach that. You either have it or you don't. His anticipation is on another level to everyone else's. Superb. So we have a breakthrough, now how will things develop from here? No doubt as to who has the momentum here now, the only doubt is how many is coming. Timely intervention. Hoists it forward. This is gone, that's a foul. Intercepted, really alert to the danger. Foden. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. He's looked long this time. That's a promising ball. Going for goal! There it is! Well, that's something that will make the manager proud because they dug in deep then and they've got their leveler. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. That was all very well drilled. This is quite a battle. Yeah, it's always a dangerous time when you've just scored. You can easily lose focus and then bang, you're pegged back again. Foden. What an adventurous run from a defender.
Sterling has a pop! Good spell of possession, this, but very little to show for it. And it's Walker. That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. And it's played forward. Stones drives it forward. Can't get the better of his opposite number. He's good for it! position to make that interception poor oh, a bus challenge oh no that's not the ball he wanted and that'll be the last act of the first half England playing their part in a real slugfest here, a glut of goals and nothing to suggest much is going to change. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen so far, both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals and I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one will be pretty crucial. So it's going to be interesting to see how the teams come out for the next period. What a good half, they've gone blow for blow, and it's 2-2. And we are already promptly back underway. Can he deliver? And that has been cleared. Oh, the ball's come loose! Decent looking ball. It's found its way to him. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. And it's Chilwell. He came in hard, very hard. I have to say, that was an exemplary tackle. Stopped him dead in his tracks. Oh, good interception. Cut out in the nick of time. Kyle Walker. Phillips. Chilwell. Rice. Tries to get it forward quickly. Tomenay. Hoists it forward. Maguire positions himself well and cuts it out. <laughs> Kyle Walker. Foden. Chilwell. Phillips. Kyle Walker. Walker. What a throw in. 
So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Foden has been withdrawn here, but he's certainly made his mark. Well, has he done enough since his goal? Is the feeling that he's lost his appetite for another? It's difficult to be sure exactly what the thinking is, but his race has certainly run now. And that's found its target. And the break is on. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Well, forward it goes. Oh, they've broken out here, and this could be the moment. Up towards the front line. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. He's through. He's away. Oh, shooting chance! England are really pouncing on any straight passes at midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. The second of the game, and an eye now for the hat-trick. England go into the lead. Nicely controlled. Well, no doubt someone is being given special treatment here. Yeah, he's been a real pest on that flank, Peter, but I think life is about to get tougher. Rice battles to win it back. Good running with the ball. Can they build on it? And he's whipped it in low. Forward it goes. Scotland are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. It's a brilliant interception. McTominay. Tierney. Robertson. Scotland going about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. It's being played forward. Has he found his man? Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but... He couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Sancho. Scotland uh, keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. Danger averted for now. the changes then in quick succession yeah it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off his energy levels began to to sag and he was never going to last until the final whistle there's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed but will they quick pull forward Maguire does well to read it and intercepts Rashford going full tilt down the left. 
England certainly don't need to overcommit now. Their priority lies further back. He's left his man. Sancho. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. Rashford. It's one. Is it? There really is no way back now. Oh, to keep his nightmare, Peter, he just couldn't pick up on it until it was way too late, having so many bodies in front of him. Well, it's the inspired substitution. Terrific move by the boss. That's how you make an impact as a sub. You know, when most are tiring, you can impose a freshness and energy to best effect. What an introduction. Scotland making consecutive changes here. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honest shift. England could not have picked a better time to snatch a two-goal lead. Is there still time for a response? Yeah. And time is up. England winners after an absolutely outstanding game. Fabulous drama as they dragged it back from behind, made it happen and won. So there it is. What struck you most about that? England made their intentions clear that nothing else but a win would do. These games are always tough.